The FDA says that the E. coli outbreak linked to romaine lettuce has sickened 43 people in 12 states. An additional 22 people in Canada are also ill. Now the agency believes this ongoing outbreak is related to what's called end of season harvest. That's happening in some parts of California. The FDA is asking lettuce producers to put the product date and the origin clearly on the label. A task force has also been established to determine better solutions that it comes to labeling lettuce for long term. That in order to help with the tracing. Lawmakers returned to Washington, D.C. this week with a need to still find a path forward on this farm bill. However, multiple measures, including 2019 appropriation bills, must also be passed in this lame duck session. The House is scheduled to leave on Thursday, December 13th, while the Senate is scheduled to adjourn on Friday, December 14th. But Congress could stay in session longer if the necessary end of your business is not completed by the targeted dates. That according to the Hagstrom report. Now leaders in the House and Senate Agriculture Committee say that they still hope to finish a farm bill this session, but they have not shown signs of reaching a final agreement as of yet. Leadership of Mexico and Canada have confirmed the two nations will sign the U.S.-Mexico-Canada Agreement Friday that replaces the North American Free Trade Agreement. Political reports that Canada's Justin Trudeau and the outgoing Mexican president will sign the pact in the Mexican officials' last day in office at the G20 summit. That's where President Trump is also expected to have trade talks with China. Now, this confirmation comes as there is no steel and aluminum tariff resolutions for Mexico and Canada, once thought to be contingent by the two nations. Well, that's a look at your agricultural news. Find out more at ruralradio.com. I'm Susan Littlefield on the Rural Radio Network. This is Mike. Mike likes his car. Mike likes to save money. And Mike likes to breathe. So Mike fills up with E15 with 15% American ethanol. The clean octane in E15 gives Mike the performance he wants from his engine and the clean air he wants for his family. Better yet, E15 costs less at the pump. Higher octane, cleaner air, lower cost. E15 sure gives Mike a lot to like. Discover E15 with American Ethanol.